Hi guys, welcome to day 207 of the big vlog. I'm Snare Van Dam and I'm once again in my corner, so shut up and move on with the vlog! Okay, childish nonsense out of the way. What's been going on today? Hmm, not a lot, but after the big barbecue I had yesterday with lots of people and lots of tidying up and lots of kind of normal barbecue things and getting a right sweat on, a bit like now, oh, this room is so hot you wouldn't believe, it's like a sauna and I cannot stand it much longer, I'm going to have to make this very very quick. Anyway, so after the barbecue yesterday I went to bed fairly late and it was a bit silly to do that on a Sunday when you kind of got school tomorrow type thing. So I woke up in the morning about half past four, half past five, half past six and half past seven. Closely followed by a cousin of theirs called half past eight. Oh crap, I'm late for work. Would have been okay had I not been late for work. Now, nah, all seriousness, I wasn't exactly late for work, but I was in a rush and I was very, very tired. And tiredness does a strange thing to you. It stops you wanting to do anything. Anything. <laughs> Makes you go a bit crazy. I mean, I was at a stage where even coffee couldn't help me. So what do you do in those circumstances when tiredness is taking the control of your life? What do you do? Because you can't stop and have a kip. So that leaves me with... Uh, this evening trying to get an early night and I've had PC problems which just oh, I've had to end up bringing up BT and saying look there is a problem for the 12th time can you fix it please don't give me some random bull crap saying that your internet lines fine and you know it's just absolutely fine and just sort it out yourself what can you open up Internet Explorer? No! I don't want to use Internet Explorer! It's rubbish! Etc, 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 etc. So, at the end of the conversation with BT today, it turns out that my hub, that obviously BT gave to me about three years ago, doesn't work anymore. He even made a joke the fact that it still had an aerial, okay? Now, I don't think it's that bad to have an aerial. In fact, sometimes having an aerial is quite good. Like, if you want to get reception of something. But, what do I know? I'm not BT, and I don't steal people's money. But, to be fair to BT this time round, the 12th person that I spoke to over a course of four weeks, finally, got it right. In my eyes, anyway. It's what I wanted. I wanted to get a new hub. And so I've got a new hub coming, and it's a different colour, and doesn't have an aerial. And, obviously, the spiel from BT says it's the best one in the world. Of course it is BT, you know everything about networking. So I'm going to leave it there today guys because I'm very very tired and this is as much as I can pump out of my brain today. So um, that's probably another screensaver for you if you pause it. But pff, that might even be on a t-shirt one day. Ding! So guys thanks for watching once again, I know it's a very short vlog um, in comparison to my normal lots of time. But I love you all, and you are the snared and you have been. So until tomorrow, when I can probably do something a little bit more than just go, oh, I'm so tired, I just want to go to bed. I shall love you and leave you. Goodbye.